I currently have a week's break. Well, not really break because I have exams afterwards, but like a week off school before I go back to two more weeks of exams. And then I finally finish for summer, which I cannot wait for. But today I'm taking a day off revision and I'm going to London to go see one of my friends, Lily. We're going to go shopping. We're going to go for dinner. A very exciting day. I cannot wait. And the weather is like beautiful today. I can't really see on the camera, but the weather's lovely. And I thought I would film a little get ready with me. But I love it because I feel like doing your makeup in summer is just so much nicer when you're tan. But I'm going to do a little updated makeup tutorial a little summer glowy makeup tutorial because i've been having so many questions on my recent makeup routine especially on tiktok and i've received a bunch of new things so i wanted to give you guys a whole little update and just some fun content because i've missed vlogging like so much so here we are i'm gonna start with my makeup and i also just wanted to like have a catch up with you guys like a little chit chat get ready with me because i love these yesterday i went to the like black panther premiere and it was honestly so so good by the way i'm gonna start off i always use this literally every day I don't actually know what it's called. I'll put it on the screen. It literally makes your skin like glow. I've had so many confidence on my skin since using this. But yeah, it was literally amazing. There was like the orchestra playing as the film was playing. It was just such a cool experience. It was at Royal Albert Hall in London. And I feel like literally anything in that, that hall is just amazing. And oh my God, it was my first red carpet. It wasn't really a red carpet. It was like kind of a small red carpet, but I got to walk down like the little red carpet. It was so fancy. I literally love doing stuff like that. Like it's just so cool that I'm able to experience stuff like that. That. and someone asked for a photo with me like i don't know why i still don't really see myself as like that big on social media so when people ask for photos i'm like yeah of course i actually forgot i've been using the walida skin food just like under my eyes a bit i saw this go viral on tiktok and i've literally had it for so long and i just never really used it but it is so thick i'm not sure i would apply it to my whole face but i just like putting a bit like under my eyes because when i put concealer on it always cracks if it's not super moisturized okay and then primers at the moment i've been loving the little refi refi like roll-on primer i'm massively into skin prep before doing my makeup because i think it just makes your makeup look so much better you know i don't even know if this is like the best primer i've used i love applying it like it's so much fun to apply to be fair it does make my skin glowy so i do like it so i'm gonna start off with concealer if you've watched any of my makeups before you know i'm like a nars concealer girl to my core but this is way too light for my face now and i haven't had time to buy a like a new one yet i will maybe today actually but then say you also sent me this like this other one but it's a bit too dark so i've sort of just been mixing the two on my face the last couple days which has sort of been working hang on that's the light one this isn't what i'd normally do i just need to get myself a different um concealer it will have to do for today <laughs> Okay, I normally use a beauty blender, but just because I'm like, want to mix them, I'm going to use my fingers just for under my eyes. So I feel like under my eyes are now moisturized. The concealer just applies so much better. Okay, and then I'm going to go in with the Gatsby Eyebrow Gel. This is literally the only stuff that keeps my eyebrows in place because everything else, my eyebrows just like, fall i don't know i don't fill in my eyebrows just because i feel like they're quite thick anyway but i just like to brush them up and hold them in place give my face you know a little lift anyway as i said at the start of the video i'm gonna carry on talking this week i have a week off it's like a week off but it's more just like you're not going to school because i'm still gonna have to be revising almost every day i've taken today off because i have two more weeks of exams afterwards and the ones after this week are even harder than the ones before so it's a tough two weeks after but then after those two weeks i don't have school at all anymore like i get a longer summer because i'm in year 11. i also have prom at the end of june and unlike in america when i'm pretty sure you guys get like proms every year in the uk you sort of have like one one main prom like your whole life and that's at the end of secondary school which is the one that i'm going to at the end of june and i got my dress the other day i've got my heels i'm still going to be deciding like accessories but i actually cannot wait next i'm going in with the charlotte tilbury contour wand this has not changed forever like i've always used this but i've been using the say like um i don't actually know what this brush is called i'll put it on the screen as well but it's so good at like blending it it just makes it look a lot more natural because i'm not a fan of like you know harsh contour lines i also don't contour my forehead because my forehead naturally is darker than the rest of my face when i tan i don't i don't know why it just always tans quicker than the rest of my face so i just sort of contour the rest to even it out look how nice it just blends in what is remaining on the brush though i'll just sort of go on my forehead i also bought the charlotte tilbury blush the other day but i am still such a sucker for the glossier cloud paint like it's like i just love the color i think i think it's the color i think it just really suits me like the color of the cloud paint in dusk okay i apply it like 
the upper part of my cheeks and then I'm just gonna use my fingers again to blend it in. I forgot who I was watching. I was watching some sort of like Vogue makeup tutorial and she described doing her makeup as like finger painting, which I thought was so funny. But the reason why I like doing my makeup with like my hands sometimes is because you can like feel your face and where to blend it in. Okay, so during exams, I have to have like a minimum 10 minute Pinterest scroll, scroll, scroll each day. Just as like a little reward, right? So every night before I go to bed, I'll scroll on Pinterest for, you know, 10, 15 minutes. And the last few nights I've been looking at festival outfits <sighs> so excited. I think cunning outfits actually gives me like serotonin. It makes me so happy. But Pinterest has just been like a godsend the last few weeks. I've been on it religiously. I'm pretty sure my screen time on Pinterest is not great. But it's been making me so, so excited for summer. A massive trend that I cannot wait for to wear in summer, especially as linen trousers. I'm also just thinking, you know, holiday outfits, the long dresses, the long flowy skirts. Like honestly, just all of it. I cannot wait. But I am going to put some of this on my nose and on my eyes. Just a bit of a subtle, bit of subtle eyeshadow, but not really. And I use this brush. Spectrum B07. I don't know where I got it from. I think that is something I might need to invest in this summer. Some more makeup brushes. Setting spray, the MAC Prep and Prime Fix It. You know what? I don't even know if this works that well, but I just love the smell of it because it's coconut and I'm such a coconut lover. Like, I love coconut scents. So I'm going to spray this all over my face until it's a bit wet. I might just do a little bit of eyeliner, like, on my inner, inner corner of my eyes, but just a little bit. Finally, I'm just going to use a bit of lip liner. This is literally the Maybelline one. Um, I'm pretty sure I just got it in, like, a boots or something so already you know finish off i'm just add some clear lip gloss okay and our makeup is complete those are my current like fave products that i've been using at the moment as well okay my loves it is outfit time this is definitely wonky so i have an idea of what i'm gonna wear and then i'm gonna try it on and if it looks good i'll keep it and if it doesn't we'll change but i thrifted this tank top in berlin oh no in amsterdam actually um and i haven't worn it yet but it's just a, like a plain red cami and i really like it and then i was thinking so i was gonna go basic but then add up like some accessories so i have these low-waisted jeans from weekday they're like so so comfy and then i saw this picture on Pinterest of this girl wearing a red cami and she sort of had a red like red knickers coming out of a white denim skirt and it looked so good. I'm thinking some red knickers coming out the jeans and then I'm gonna play around with accessories and see. Okay like it's cute but I feel like because this is such a deep red it might work better with darker jeans like more of a deep blue jean. I don't know but I'm loving the tank top. I don't normally wear red. I'm gonna try and change out the jeans and see. Then, okay a hundred percent like 110 percent. The tree jeans. I love the back pockets of these. I'm also gonna try out a belt and see how that looks. I don't know. I feel like this could be cute. Okay, I have this little box of jewelry. So jewelry wise, I sort of have the same rotation of jewelry, which is like the same three rings. This one from Brandy. This is a little signet ring. Okay, I cannot find the other ring that I normally wear. So I'm just gonna wear this like little croissant one. I think it's from H&M. Or I'm even gonna keep in these little hoops. I'm thinking of these like bigger ones. I feel like the bigger ones go more. I love a chunky gold hoop. These are from New Look, I'm pretty sure. And I've just ordered a taxi to take me to the station because my parents are out. So let's go. Giving it a solid 8.3 out of 10. Coffee? I'll give it like a 7. Ooh, 7. I'm, I'm a bit harsh on my ratings. <laughs> took some little photo booth pics they're so cute on the first one we didn't realize they was gonna go so the first one just us like looking at each other like what are we doing but that's adorable is sort of like homemade second not homemade is it homemade it's like it's like a mix of little individual stores yeah. in one shop it's so cute i just got a pair of earrings and then this is the home floor oh lady got a new ring from ashton and mew yeah ashton and mew
is just in Space MK. It's super busy at the moment, so I'm sorry if I've been a bad vlogger, but there's so many people out today. I think because the weather's nice. Um, I didn't end up getting anything, but she's getting the drunk elephant moisturizer, I think. Either a moisturizer or a makeup remover, maybe. But we're gonna head to Covent Garden, and then we're going out for dinner tonight at Sushi Samba. How the fuck did I do? Break me so we just came back to Lily's little apartment that she's renting in London. I tried on the dress. I'm gonna show you guys, but I'm wearing a black bra right now, and I probably have to wear it with like a white bra because it's sort of see through at the front. It's sort of like a chair in the way. This is the little white dress I got though. It's really really pretty. I got this little. Pink dress. It's so cute. I think this color like looks really good on Lil. But yeah, I want to get it tailored so it's like more fitting around here. And then I'd obviously wear it like a white bra. But I thought it was cute. And because it was only like 15 pounds, bloody bargain. Bargain? <laughs> I'm gonna get changed back into the jeans though because I don't have a bra to go under this dress, which is really upsetting. And then we're gonna go out for food. We're getting sushi. <gasps> it's sushi's like both our favorite foods. Like every time we meet up, it's like we yeah. always get like sushi dog. I go to sushi dog every single time I'm in London. Love sushi dog. It's currently 9.53. I got an Uber from Sushi Samba Sushi Sushi Samba to the train station and I'm from the train back now. If you can't tell, I am so tired. But I've literally had well, such a good 21. day. And I love a bit of a shopping trip. I hope you all enjoyed the video. I'm literally gonna go home and go to bed and sleep. Um but I love you all lots.